Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you kind of how to graph, kind of step-by-step -step process, um, how to graph in standard form. Uh, I'm sorry, how to graph using your intercept method. So basically, with the intercept method, what we're trying to do is identify what the x and the y intercept are, plot them, and connect. So um, basically, the first thing we want to do is make sure that they're in standard form. And I think this is not not absolutely necessary, but I think it's very helpful to make sure where a, b, and c um, are going to be um, whole numbers. And I think sometimes this helps, especially with the math um, going on, but to get rid of any fractions. All right, Make sure a, b, and c are going to be um, whole numbers without any fractions. So put, make sure it's in standard form. And when it's in standard form, basically all we're going to do to solve by intercept method is we're going to say, all right, well, we know that Okay, here is the y-axis, here is the x-axis. If there's a point that lies on the x-axis, we know that the value of the y coordinate is automatically going to be 0. right? So that's going to be x comma 0. Any point that lies on the y-axis, we know that the x, at x coordinate is always going to be 0, and we're going to have a y coordinate. So if we want to solve for x and y, to solve for y, we just plug 0 in for x and then solve the equation and solve for y, or solve for the y value, which will be, your y, um, which will be the y value for your y-intercept. Then, to solve for the x value for the x-intercept, you put 0 in for y, because that's what y is for the x-intercept, and then solve for the intercept. Then, once you know those two values, you plot them and then connect. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you graph um, a, a equation in standard form using your slope, or your, not your slope, your intercept form. Thanks.